Hello everyone. Today I will explain the chapter seven timer. There are three timers T0, T1, T2 inside the D1 T5 well chip. The T0 and the T1 timers are used in exact the same way as the standard C51. While the T2 timer is used in the extension of the T5 well chip on the basic of the standard C51. This T2 timer is a little bit special. It can only work in the 16-bit auto-load automatic reload mode. The clock frequency of the T0 and the T1 timer is 1 in 12 of the CPU's main frequency. The clock frequency of the T2 timer can be configured at the main frequency of 1 in 12 or 1 in 24 CPU. The relevant register relationship is shown below. Let's first look at the TCON, T0, T1 control registers, which are the same as the standard A051 and can be addressable by bit. Mainly look at T2 con. Set the T2 register. The seventh bit is the clock frequency division selection. Write 0 means the CPU main frequency is 1 in 12. Write 1 means the CPU main frequency is 1 in 14. The sixth to fourth must be right in 1. And the third and to one must be right zero. Zero is used to start the T2 timer. The following two is the count value of the timers. And the last two are the auto reload registers. Next, let's see how to calculate the timing period of the timer. For example, if we set the T1 timer to 5 milliseconds, then how to calculate the timing count value? It is to calculate the value of the TS0, TL0, TH1, and TL1. There are three steps here. First, calculate the main frequency of the CPU. The D1 T5 L chip use a 11.0592 MHz crystal oscillator. We can look at the schematic diagram. We can see that the 11.0592 MHz crystal oscillator is used. The second step is to calculate the clock frequency of the timer, which is represented by timer clock. There are two formulas. The T0 and the T1 timers can only use formula 1, while the T2 timer can use two formulas. The seventh bit of the T2 cone register is used to choose whether to use Formula 1 or Formula 2. Next comes to the key step, the third step, calculation of the timing period of the timer, represented by T. Then the final result calculated by the formula is converted into hexadecimal, and the value of the THX register is the upper 8 bit, which is BC. The value of the TLX register is the lower 8 bits, which is CD. Next, let's look at the function introduction of this chapter. We use the T0 timer to time the 1 millisecond cycle. Generate a 1 millisecond cycle flag in the interrupt service routine of the T0 timer. And then use this 1 million second cycle flag to make the counter variable increment by 1. 
and finally in the main loop. Update this counter variable to this interface. For GUI design, using a data variable display control. First, we now create a new code folder on the desktop and create a new C51 and GUI folder under the code folder. And then create a new template folder under the GUI folder. Then open the latest software. Click Lew and select Resolution and File Path. Here we need to add a background image because the image production is relatively simple. I have drawn it in advance. Then back to the software and add the background image. Here we need to generate the ICL. Click the ICL generator. Select background image. Click generate ICL. Save it to the DSL folder and name it 32. Then add the data variable display control. Set the corresponding parameters. Then click save and generate. We need to download the DUNSET folder to the screen via SD card. Copy the DUNSET folder to SD card. Insert the SD card and power it on. When it shows end, Power off and unpack the SD card. You can see the picture has been displayed. We can write through the code in chapter 1. Here I have written it in advance. You can use it directly. Open the software. It should be noted here that the T2 timer is already occupied. And the T2 register is used here to achieve precise delay. In this chapter, we use the T0 register. Here is the finished C51 code. Click Compile. We can see that there shows no errors and warnings. Then we use download for a 051 software to download the code. Select zero port and select the correct field. When the download is completed, the data can be added by itself. <coughs> At this time, the explanation of chapter 7 is completed. Thank you for watching.